Eric, well, Santa is not just bringing gifts for the kids. Yeah, there'll also be something under the tree for our pets, and consumer expert Amy Davis is here. Some of the hottest pet gifts. Yeah, it depends on how much you like them, right? Are you <laughs> exactly. guys pet gifts? I, I do. <laughs> I, and I know you love your dogs. So. We do. Yes, okay. All right, so pet parents will spend a record amount on their furry kids this year, thanks in part to more luxury and high-tech pet products. Oh, good boy. Most pets made it on the nice list this year. Good boy. 80% will be getting gifts, according to pet care site Rover.com. That childlike joy, you can see it in dogs, too. A growing number of pet owners, including this one, are opting for high-end accessories. Last year, we got the Furbo because that was, you know, new and exciting. The Furbo is a two-way interactive camera for about $134. It dispenses treats right out of here. You can do it remotely via the app. With video calling to see and talk to your pet remotely. Technology has really kind of invaded the pet gift industry. Wicked Bone is a smart toy for 100 bucks, controlled through an app with autoplay and manual controls. <laughs> Tech that's appealing to this dog owner. One of my dogs demolishes toys, another dog's an escape artist. The Whistle 3 can keep tabs on troublemakers with GPS and activity tracking. It's a little bit like a Fitbit. It's $100 for the device and $10 a month for the GPS feature. Track mode. There are also DNA tests, designer duds, selfie phone accessories, even TV channels for pets. <laughs> but perhaps some of these luxury gifts are more for the owner than the pet. Dogs have always needed the same thing, food, water, love, and exercise. Good. Yep, so while you're including your pets in the holiday festivities, you still got to be careful. Keep treats out of reach. Chocolate and an artificial sweetener called xylitol, they're both toxic to animals. That xylitol is in a lot of sugar-free gum. Plants like holly, mistletoe, and lily should also always be kept away from pets. I was always told poinsettias, too. Yeah, absolutely. Those are... Yeah. Got to be careful. Exactly. Thanks. They're so cute.